Good morning. Um, thank you for being here. Um, I want to first thank Sydney Basley, who's our water director. You can see he's in the same clothes that he was wearing last night because he's been here all night, he and his team. Obviously, what you see behind us is our emergency contractor. The good news is that the repair has been made. It was um, 20, 20 inch pipe, 20 foot repair. People are asking what happened. It was just an old pipe that the bottom collapsed out of it. You know, Sydney believes the pipe was from the 1940s. So I think the additional extreme weather we've had and the soil conditions, the drought and the freezing weather probably exacerbated that situation. But generally the pipe just was out of its useful life. Um, we can go further into that. Two years ago, um, we, the council and the administration got behind a rate increase. We have 70 projects going on in the parish now because we know we're on top of an aging system. And that's a different conversation. But just for today, just know that we're trying to rebuild pressure back into uh, the system. Um, it's going to be a slow process because we don't want to, we want to go gradually to make sure we do it right. Um, so on the East Bank, again, this is only affecting the East Bank residents. Um, you're going to see pressure build up today. Um, I don't want to give a time because I don't know and we've never been in this situation before. So I don't, I don't want to give an expectation of an exact time when, honestly, I'm going to say today you're going to see the pressure build back up as the, as the system gets re-energized. Um, again, the same message that I said last night, even though it seems normal and it seems like the pressure is coming out, out of your faucet like normal, it's not normal conditions. We're still under a boil water advisory. We have still had low pressure. Contaminants are able to get into the system when you have low pressure. We were turned off, you know, so so we've got to get back up to pressure. Uh, we have our own lab here. Sydney has staff here that's uh, chemists, and we have our own lab here in Jefferson Parish. That's a good thing, and we work closely with Louisiana Department of Health. But when the pressure gets back up to normal, we'll take the samples. The samples have to wait 24 hours before we can pass that test and lift the boil water advisory. So please, today, absolutely still under a boil water advisory. What's going on here, and we want to thank the Sheriff's Office, they helped us divert traffic this morning. You can see all of eastbound Jefferson is, uh, Highway is closed. They're picking up the old asphalt, and, and look, they had to work underwater. When I left here last night, they were still drilling. There was water covering the street. So it was a big deal that the repair got made last night and we we're able to try to re-energize the system this morning. Um, but you can see they're trying to clean this up. They intend to pour the asphalt today. Obviously the rain situation uh, is a circumstance we're dealing with, but we're trying to do as quickly as possible, get at least one lane of Jefferson Highway open again. So we'll be working through the day, working on that. I'm gonna turn it over to Sydney, who's really the expert on all things about pressure. Um, so people can understand a little bit in more detail what's, what's happening throughout the rest of the day. So, so as she spoke about, we're right now building a pressure back up. The repair was completed this morning. So right now the plant is just moving very slowly to get the pressure in the area and it's going to disperse out to the far ends of the East Bank. Right now we do have some pressure in the water towers. They're creeping up very, very slow. So you're going to see a little bit the pressure increase in your home, but just know that we're still under a ball water advisory. We're going to have pressure here around the plant. But as the day goes on, people in the far out like Kenner, the north end of Metairie, they're going to start to see the pressure a little bit later in the day. 